Good morning. It's Friday. Yay. <laughs> it's been a very, very busy and hectic week, but it's the weekend. So we have some plans. I'm not sure what they are, but I plan to go on a mini vacay. So that's good. Um, but today I wanted to show you some antiquing that my buddy and I did last weekend on our way home from the mountains. Uh, as I said, we don't really go antiquing that often. It's not a destination of choice for us, but there's this sweet little town on the way to the mountains called Exeter, and they have lots of antique shops and one in particular that we frequent a lot. Uh, I think it's called Under the Water Tower. And I bought the most unusual thing there. So I'll take a tour of the antique store for you, and then I'll show you what I bought. Have a great weekend. Look at all the fun fall Halloween things here. Pretty little horn ornaments. Turkeys, signs, more turkeys, a crow. Ooh, that's pretty sparkly. I love these little chandeliers. Look at all the tchotchkes here. Wow. Old banks, occupied Japan ceramics, souvenir spoons, old fashioned spice tins, coffee tins. Hmm. Cookie cutters. And over here looks like all kinds of tools. Kitchen tools. Marbles. Corkscrews. Look at all these oil pans. So fun. Here's some garden antiques. Kinda love these little birds, don't you? Here's the place to be. So many beautiful Halloween things. Oh, I love this hat tree here. Oh my goodness, look at her. She's spectacular. Look at this armoire. Ooh, I'd love that in my cabin. Oh my goodness, this is just Halloween in here. I love these little boos. at this pretty haunted house. This blue Danube china is beautiful, but they're selling it by the piece, so it'd be super expensive. Here's an old sewing machine. I actually have one exactly like this in storage. It was my grandma's. You will definitely be surprised at what I bought. 
This is what I bought at the antique store. They're called Nodders, salt and pepper Nodders. Look, the little fish Nod. Are they the cutest? Oh my goodness. Plus, look, here's the pepper. It has the little cork on the bottom. The salt does not have a cork, so I'd have to replace that if I were gonna use them. I don't know if I'd even use them. They're just so cute. They're my little salt and pepper fishy nodders <laughs> from our 40th anniversary antiquing weekend. <laughs>